So a new trailer dropped for Venom a couple days ago. I'm a little bit late, but let's do this. I'm Eddie Brock. I'm a reporter. I always seem to find myself questioning something the government may not be looking at. I found something really bad. And I have been Who's that bad? Who's that bad? Taken. Look around at the world. What do you see? A planet on the brink of collapse. Human beings are disposable. But man and symbiote combined. This is a new race, a new species. A higher life form. What do you want from me? You will find out. I am so sorry. We cannot just hurt people. Look into my eyes, Eddie. The way I see it. We can do whatever we want. <laughs> we have a deal. Eyes, lungs, pancreas, so many snacks for a little time. That power, it's not completely awful. You have no idea how much you're scaring me right now. Eddie, cooperate. And you just might survive. Guys, you do not want to do this, trust me. Giant leaps will always come at a cost. Parasite. Yeah. Name is Chen. All right, before I dive into it and give you my full thoughts on the whole thing, I want to watch it a second time. But while I'm watching it a second time, go ahead and tell me down below in the comment section, what did you think about the trailer? Are you buying into it? Is it too weird, too strange, too out there? All that fun stuff. Do you love to talk movies way too much? You're in the right place. Join us in the comment section. Now I've got to watch this trailer a second time. So what did I think about this trailer? Man, I'm still really torn. Uh, the more they show me, both the more I'm kind of like, okay, I can see what I'm gonna really like about this movie. I can see the little flavors and the humor and the kind of brutality of it, the anti-hero nature of it that I'm really gonna like. Um, and then I see other sides that I'm like, man, I'm not sure if that works. I'm not quite sure if there's talking heads spinning around, voices in his head. In this context, in this setting, I'm not gonna, really sure if it's gonna work inside of this movie. The obvious comparison for this year right now is a movie came out a couple months back called Upgrade, starring Logan Marshall Green, who looks like Tom Green and has like robotic upgrades to him. So this AI inside of him is talking to him in the movie and he can't always control what he's doing. He's kind of like in shock at what's happening to him. And so watching this trailer, that popcorn I was eating earlier just kind of came back up my throat. So, um, but you see that in this trailer too, of except a symbiote and this guy that looks like Logan Marshall Green, also kind of with the uh, sorts of look on his face that you saw in Upgrade as the symbiote's kind of controlling him. There's this back and forth dialogue, which is an interesting sort of thing. So the th movie that might make me most think that this movie can work is Upgrade, the movie that's a little bit too similar to this one. So beyond that, what other thoughts did I have? Um, 
I, I, that last scene at the end might have won me over a little bit. That might have been the one that kind of pushed me over into, yeah, I, I think I, I think I'm gonna like where this is going, and hopefully they're holding back on some of the a lot of the venom stuff as they've and like the first trailer had no venom in it. The second one had just a little bit, and this one had a lot of venom, but we only had limited dialogue. I mean, you've got that one long bit at the end where you go, oh, is that where this is going? Which I, that bought me into, like, I'm like, yeah, okay, I'm tracking with that. But then on the other side, I, I think about that and I go, that, the, the whole venom, I'm gonna eat your arms and your face stuff, doesn't fully match with the, the tone of the rest of it, because the rest of it didn't have kind of this dark humor of, you'll roll down the streets like a turd in the wind. I don't even know what that accent was. But like, it doesn't have that. And so I'm, even the part that I was like, oh, that might have won me over, I also kind of go, how does that fit with the rest of it? How does this consistently fit together? And I'm not, I'm not really sure. So all in all on this one, I'm still, still mixed on it. I'm not quite sure where I land on it because there's things that are really interesting and then there's things about it that I just don't know. <laughs> it's just too odd, kind of to, to pulls you out of a little bit, too weird. And certainly, at least for me, I don't know about you, but for me, it pulled me out just a little bit in the way certain things, things were handled in it. So, and I, I'm interested by the marketing on this one too, because you watch that first teaser trailer they put out, there's no venom in it, it looks, uh, you see a little bit of the symbiote, it just looks kind of like a generic action movie from the 90s or something like that. And then to this one where it's like full venom, eat your arms, whatever that, that shot right before the title card happens where he's like multiple heads, body parts everywhere, whatever that shot is. Um, I mean, this is full comic booky. They're all in weird comic book stuff in this trailer. So man, I, I'm curious. I'm very curious about it, especially because Tom Hardy, he doesn't just pick anything. He doesn't just go for any movie out there. He picks movies that he finds interesting. He takes roles that he finds interesting. And so the fact that he took this one, I'm curious. I'm curious as to how this will all play out. But tell me your thoughts down below in the comments section. If you like this video, check out one of these playlists right over here with some other great content talking about some amazing movies that hopefully I think that you will enjoy. And thank you for watching.